weekend to kind of evaluate, think back on things. What what things different would you like to see out of this offense? Um, I think uh, personally, it just starts with me. I just got to play a little bit better. Uh, just want us to be a little bit more explosive, be able to, you know, be on the same page um, and just play how we know we can play. Because of injuries and other things, you had some new receivers out there. Um, and plus, you Dante kind of became more of a target. Did you find some things in your receiving core that really worked for you? Yeah, I think Trey had a really good game. Um, I think Saturday really boosted his confidence level and showed that, you know, how talented of a receiver he can be. And then Seif, too, just going out there and making plays. Um, I know his confidence kind of dropped earlier in the season, but he's a fully capable receiver, um, a guy that can make plays for us down the stretch, and I think he showed that on Saturday night as well. Uh, coach came in here a few minutes ago and said he might encourage the offense to start using you more as a uh, runner in his last two games. said use the term cut it loose in the run game with you. Just what, what are your thoughts on that? Yeah, I think, you know, just at this point, whatever I can do to help the team win and I'm obviously um, have shown that I could be a dangerous runner and haven't been able to, to showcase that um, these these past few weeks. But um, definitely excited about that, being able to go out there and, and just show what I can do with my legs and um, kind of getting in that mindset uh, earlier in the week, right starting right now of going out there and, and just trying to exploit some things with my legs. And how hard or weird of a moment was was it for you when you pitched the ball to Dylan and see him, you know, have to hobble out of bounds there? Yeah, he was kind of moving his his. Um, uh, you could kind of tell he was a little bit banged up on the sideline and didn't really know what was going on and just kind of pitching the ball and see him go out of bounds. Um, luckily, he he's you know doing okay. He made it to the sideline and, and everything's fine. So just continuing to talk to him and you know it's kind of. Kind of, it was just a weird kind of situation to be in. Avery, what does the senior class meant to you? It means a lot. You know, we have a lot of guys that have been here for a long time. Um, a handful of captains in that group, guys that, you know, took me in with open arms, you know, showed me the, the ropes, you know, taught me how to be a better person, better leader. So just continuing to, you know, fight for those guys as the season goes on. How important is it to send those seniors off? I guess, on a high note in their final game at Bill Snyder Family Stadium? I mean, you know, it's probably one of the biggest things um, for us right now, just fighting for those guys, you know, getting one more one more win in the bill for them, um, being able to have a good senior night and ultimately finish the the, the season 2-0 and for them so those, those guys can, you know, kind of go out with a bang. You also feel like you have something to prove to the fans after a home loss? Come this coming Saturday. Um, yeah, I mean, you never you never want to lose, um, especially in front of your home home crowd and the the fans come out and, and shot for us week in and week out. So um, it was definitely disappointing to you know let them down on on Saturday, but ultimately just gotta you know come come back and fight for for all of our supporters, everybody in in this building, and you know we got a lot of competitors um, on our team that just want to win. So. Um, even though it's only been two losses in a row, just with the bye week and how everything works, it's it'll be about a month that you guys since you guys have won. How how much like mental toughness wise? How much does that kind of test that for you? Uh, I mean, nobody wants to lose, so that's pretty much what I have to say about that. I mean, uh, long time without a win. Um, ultimately, just got to treat it like one week season. You know, put that in the rear view and continue to just find a way to, to get the win this week.